My channel if you're new here my name is Nassim I'm 37 I do keto vlog keto hauls meal preps keto reviews of products all things keto just basically my keto lifestyle getting through life as a single mom and just yeah it's just a vlog so um, from time to time I'll just do you know special videos of grocery hauls which I haven't had any lately because I really haven't been able to go grocery shopping lately if you know what I mean um, got bills to pay yeah work hours cut whatever but we're getting by so um, this is the part of the video where I tell you what I'm eating for breakfast oh my god I'm so messed up this is the part of the video where I tell you what I'm eating for lunch and what I had for breakfast but for First, I have four beautiful kids. Two of them have a birthday today. It is November 5th, it is Tuesday, and my twin boys, Reese and Peyton, are 11 years old today. 11, 11 years ago, I gave birth to those two boys. How in the heck did they even get to be 11? I do not know. These boys, I did it all by myself, you guys. At the time, I was married to their father. Uh, he didn't help. Um, there was many times I was carrying two car seats at once um, to go grocery shopping. I I've always had to bring all of my kids with me. Even when I was married, I was pretty much a single mom. Um, a lot of you know my history with their father and he's currently in prison. Um, not the best uh, person or uh, fatherly person either. Um, but yeah, a lot of the times, I mean, he never, I can count probably on my hand the amount of time, times he changed a diaper. I did bath time. I did brush your teeth time. I did bedtime. I did everything. So yes, I did it on my own and I'm amazed that I did it on my own when I think back and I think back at taking those boys and Tiffany being two years old and them being newborns and Corey being seven or eight and you know, and I had two step kids. So a lot of the times I had six kids with me and and I did it by myself and it makes me teary-eyed to think back at all the struggles we had you know all the Christmases that I just didn't have any money and um, had to tell my kids like don't worry Santa will come next week he he's making special toys for you you know how hard is it to try to explain to your kids you don't have they they don't have anything because their dad stole all the money to get drunk um, I try to smile about it now because I'm giving them a better life and everything that I do now is for them. <sighs> I got like emotional there. I don't know how this went from there. I'm just, I'm, ex I'm excited for them and I'm happy and I'm proud of them. They're freaking smart. They're smart little boys and everything in the past, like it's just, they're so resilient and it's not affected them. And I'm so thankful that it's not. They are amazing children, all four of them. I love them so much. So when I say I have four beautiful kids, I mean it. And a floofy fluffy husky and two kitty kitties. And I really do love the clicky clickies. And I'm sorry for being so emotional. So early in the video, it's a joyous occasion. It is their birthday last night. Um, I didn't have the money to go buy them a cake. So I was gonna make them a cake and I had like laundry to do and everything. So Josh the rescue, Uncle Josh, my roommate, my friend since I was in first grade, if you didn't know that story, um, he offered to make the cake while I folded laundry. I had a lot of laundry to fold. So he did that and then we weren't gonna have a frosting but he made a homemade frosting. So I'll show you that cake later. I can't eat it, but it doesn't matter. They can eat it. Um, so they're gonna have a nice cake for their birthday and I bought them each a game on their Xbox. So it's a good day. We're gonna have a good day and I have some chicken um, to cook. So we'll see what they want me to do with that chicken they get to pick um yeah so lunch guys um i don't know how much i'm going to be able to eat because i froze my keto chow last night thinking it would be thawed by the time it was lunch and it is not i mean it's kind of but it's not it sure tastes good but it's sure still frozen and i don't have a spoon oh it's this a spoon oh no i thought it was a spoon so I guess uh, lunch will have to be later, but this is keto chow. This is strawberry. It's made with MCT oil. Again, yes, I know that yesterday my stomach was gurgling and growling, but I didn't do anything after that. I was fine. So, um, 
yeah this is strawberry keto chow made with four to five ounces of almond milk unsweetened just unsweetened almond milk i'm sorry i'm all over the place um a fourth cup of mct oil and the rest water so breakfast i just had two cups of the macadamiac um bones coffee with two teaspoons of pure and a little scoop of the mct powder and some a splash of almond milk i'm gonna get off of here because i'm rambling i am talking like a mad person and my sentences aren't really making sense so um before i leave i do have some of the built boost which i'm gonna say it i've been drinking it since i got it and i i'm not getting increased energy so unless you have to drink this for weeks and weeks before you overall feel good i'm not sure i mean i get it there's vitamins in it and stuff but if you're looking for energy i would not go this route if you're looking for that caffeine energy that zip Fizz gives you i would still stick to zip Fizz. if you're looking for a natural over time then yes bill boost so i'm getting off of here i'm i'm not even sure i'm making sense okay bye all right so i have some chicken that was taken out and um it's just like three big chicken breasts i'm going to slice that slice slice them in half and then i'm going to just cook them in some avocado oil inside of a pan this looks like tiffany's handwriting she left them a little note happy birthday boys reese and peyton the big 11. why that's sweet of you and then here is their cake that Josh made. And I gave him the idea to add some cocoa powder to the chocolate or to the buttercream frosting and add some coconut flakes in since the cake mix was for a German chocolate cake. So that's what the cake is looking like. See you when dinner's ready. Hey guys, I have a. Uh, unexpected delivery i knew it was coming i didn't know it was coming today so um a company called nutstop reached out to me i want to make sure i'm not showing the yeah okay so a company called nutstop.com reached out to me and asked me if i would be interested in um picking some products from their website and trying some of them and you know just showing them on my channel and using them and some recipes and stuff so i went through they have a lot of good options they have a lot of good keto options they have non-keto options as well they have dried fruit they have some almond flour they have coconut flakes they have they have a lot of stuff so I picked out, they said 10 to 15 items. Um, they did tell me that they were out of the coconut flakes because I did ask for the unsweetened coconut flakes because I was gonna I was gonna try to use them in some sort of recipe. Um, look at this, the size of this box, okay? Because it, everything is a pound. So we're gonna open it up. The camera I did get one thing not keto because I, I got it for the kids. So right off the bat, holy freaking cow all right this is huge so the first thing that we have are these raw pistachio kernels and the macros are all on the back here these are um nine total carbs with three fiber um six protein 14 fat it is uh da, 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 110 calories for a fourth cup so this is one pound of these raw pistachio kernels. I have one pound of raw walnuts. Six carbs for walnuts, you guys. Six total carbs with three fiber. So that's three net carbs. 20 fat, this is, they are full of fat. And six grams of protein. I like sprouts. Aha, here we are organic coconut flour organic coconut flour yes i like it so i got me some coconut flour um roasted salted pistachios these are in the shell same as the others brazil nuts roasted and salted i've never had a brazil nut but they're three total carbs. They're two fiber, four protein, 19 grams of fat, 185 calories. No, 195 calories. I'm sorry. I've never had a Brazil nut. They're actually pretty big. And the serving size is a fourth cup um, for 
one net carb, that's not too bad. I don't know what this is. This right here is packaged up pretty well. I'll just find I don't know what this is. What are these? I got more. Those are little ice packs. Oh, this is what I got for the kids. I got this and they, if you order the chocolate things, they put little cold packs in it to help keep them from melting. So I got this for the kids. This is milk, milk chocolate peanut patties, 25 carbs. We're not gonna be eating that one fiber, 20 grams of sugar. We're not gonna be eating that, but this is for the kids. And then I also got this for the kids, these cocoa dusted almonds. These are 22 carbs, 16 grams of sugar. But I thought, hey, if I'm getting all these nuts, the least I could do is get them a couple of things that they can enjoy. I got some um, salted roasted almonds, five total carbs, four grams of fiber, six protein, 15 total fat, 170 calories, fourth cup. It seems as all the servings are a fourth cup. I got some almond flour. I got some slivered raw almonds. I got those for some recipes, especially with the holidays coming up. I am going to be making all kinds of stuff. Um, some raw hazelnuts. I've never had a hazelnut. I love the taste of hazelnut, peanut butter, and coffee and everything, but I've never had a hazelnut. So, um, five total carbs, three fiber, five protein, 18 grams of fat, 180 calories. I'm excited to try that. I cannot believe this is so much. Pecan pieces, uh, so many ideas for these. Four grams, four total carbs, two grams of fiber, three grams of protein, 21 grams fat. Raw pecans. Four total carbs, three fiber, three protein, 21 grams fat. Raw macadamia nuts. Now you guys know macadamia nuts are expensive. <coughs> so this raw macadamia nut, five total carbs, three fiber, two protein, 18 grams. I'm very excited for the macadamia nuts. Very excited. And then there's some roasted macadamia nuts, roasted and salted. Very, very excited to try world. those. Huh? I love the squirrels too, they're so cute. I love these bags. Roasted salted cashews. These are a little bit higher. These are eight total carbs, one fiber, six grams of protein and 13 fat. But I would like to make some dishes for Chris. Um, obviously not the the roasted salted but I also got regular cashews and same macros but I would like to um, put that into like he likes this garlicky chicken thing so I'd like to use that to try to make some sort of dish but I'm going to be you know baking trying new recipes doing all kinds of things with these nuts tons and tons of nuts now yeah. Right now, I'm going to try each and every nut. No, I'm gonna. I mean, I know what most nuts no. taste like. I'm gonna taste the nuts I don't know what they taste like. You can taste them too if you'd like. Okay. This is a hazelnut. Have you ever had a hazelnut? Not you, Linky. I don't know if dogs can have hazelnuts. That's Alexa. Alexa, can dogs have hazelnuts? Hazelnut is not considered poisonous to dogs. However, hazelnut may still contain ingredients that are individually toxic to dogs, and so you should always that. check with your she veterinarian before feeding you your pet hazelnut? any new foods. She'd say that to dog food. All right, you want to try one, Corey? We'll try it at the same time. Ready? No, he spit it out. Of course he did. I've had a hazelnut before. You've never had a hazelnut? Mm-hmm. Doesn't taste a lot to me because I have no. It doesn't really taste like what I expected it to taste like. 
Other thing I wanted to try was these macadamia nuts. Let me show them. Love macadamia nuts. Cory, you want to try the macadamia nuts? Ah! It's rude. Mmm. Those are amazing. Those are good. And they're not like overly salty either. And then I wanted to try the Brazil nut. So I think what they sent me was the organic coconut flour because I didn't get the coconut flakes and he told me, um, he sent me a little bonus. So I think that's what was sent. And this came very fast. Would you like a Brazil nut? You know, I think I have had Brazil nuts. I think my mom likes Brazil nuts. Grandma? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Her favorite thing is, um, ants and all. Yes, Grandma has had Brazil nuts. I dropped my Brazil nuts. So. Hey, Kiddos. So, today I'm going to be trying some milk chocolate peanut patties. I will be, too. If my brother will be today. I'm just looking up something for you all. If I had channel, they'd be called the key toes, cause toes. Not opening. But I couldn't get open either. What is this? All right, so I have a coupon code that you guys can use to get 10% off your order if you decide to order from Nutsup. This is a great way. I mean, like I said. You can use these for holidays, upcoming holidays, for your baking. There's lots of different nuts that you can involve in baking for holidays. Um, gift baskets, things like that, that you could be making for family members. Like I said, it's not just nuts. They have dried fruits. They have nuts. They have almond flour, coconut flour, coconut flakes. I'm telling you guys, there's much more than just the nuts. Go take a look at their website. It's nutsop.com. That, lo that looks really freaking good. It it's is. caramel. It's like a snicker. They have every nut imaginable. They have all the all the chocolates that we can't have, but loved ones can. Um, anyways, the code that you can use is KM10 for Keto Mama. KM10 will get you 10% off at nutstop.com and you'll see this little cute little squirrel it's so super cute it's so hard to chew. i totally appreciate them i know that um oh, I, I, I feel very blessed to have this opportunity to have these these are each a pound so and i think i think you can order bigger sizes i'm not sure i'm gonna go on their website just to show you some examples uh, I didn't know they had a sugar-free chocolate gift tray. I suck because I didn't even know. They actually have a sugar-free chocolate gift tray. I didn't know that. I d how did I not see that? I didn't even see it. I'm kind of upset about that. They have all kinds. Um, they have <laughs> trail mix. They have, um, yeah. Oh my gosh, they have so much stuff. Where's all the chocolate? Dried fruit. Yeah, they have it? cantaloupe, pears, tangerines. Apricots, dried bananas, dried cherries, dried coconuts, dried dates, dried ginger, dried kiwi. They have chia seeds, flax seeds, maca powder, ch or organic chia seeds. I don't know what that is. Hemp seeds, organic coconut flour. I must have missed this entire thing when I was ordering because I didn't see this. Organic coconut sugar, turmeric powder. Oh wow, they have all the things. Banana powder. I mean, it's it's endless, and this is a great gift to give to people. Me and Corey are going to be trying the coconut dusted almonds next. Cocoa. Like Cocoa. Let me see. You need me help? Okay, ready, Corey? Here's your. <laughs> Looks like a third. Yep, just like I thought. I don't like it. I mean, I like it. Like and subscribe for more nuts. If you have any suggestions on a recipe that I can make or something I can make with all these nuts, let me know.
I have some ideas flowing. But leave yours down below. Eat your green beans. You gave me seven, not four. Eat your seven green beans. This is what he wanted for dinner. He wanted me to fry the chicken, so we fried it and we put some Parmesan cheese, so it's like a crusted. That looks like a chicken leg, but it's really a chicken breast. And some stuffing, they love stuffing. So that's what we made, green beans, stuffing. I'm gonna be eating this and that. And they like the nuts, so that's good. All right, guys, I'm going to eat dinner. If I eat anything else, I will let you know. I'll show you my plate here in just a minute. I'll be right back. All right, guys, this is dinner. This is really one chicken breast. It's cut in half. It's got some Parmesan cheese crusted onto it, some green beans. I'm going to have some sugar-free honey barbecue sauce and then a built boot. Have a great night, guys. Bye.